everyone, I am back again with another, usually it's a hot snack challenge, but this time it's just one hot snack and a couple of two snacks that I want to try. There were only, apparently I just found out they were only branded at Walmart. Today we have three Pringle cans to review and go over. We have the Philly Cheese Steak Pringles, we have the Hot Honey Pringles and a new scorching one that I happen to locate, Scorching Buffalo. So, first one that we're going to try is the Philly Cheese Steak. It's going to be very interesting. Um, I'm just going to stop reviewing the Pringle Man on the can because I'm going to say the same thing like I have in every other Pringle Can uh, rating video. I don't like the design of the Pringle Man. I like the design of the old Pringle Man. Ah. Definitely smell the cheese on these. Can't really tell the flavoring just them. It's like it's just kind of that. Maybe it's actually embedded in the chip like they're supposed to be. Ah. Interesting. Very, very, very interesting. I don't know. You can kind of taste it. You can kind of taste the Philly cheese steak. You can definitely taste the cheese. At the same time, you can also kind of taste like it has like an also like an original Pringle bite to it as well. So it's very faint, but it's there. You can kind of taste the Philly, the Philly uh, cheese steak on it. I'm not super impressed by it, but I still enjoy it. Just, 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 just grab it. <laughs> so, how is it that so you can faintly taste it? They smell good. Yeah, they got the smell though. Time to go to the next one. Actually, wait, I am probably going to rate this a, I would say a three out of five. Mainly this batch here. Because I kind of feel like that is one of those Pringle containers that you have some of the flavor in it, and then sometimes you don't. So it was just a bad batch that was made. The next one that we're going to try is the Pringles Hot Honey. It doesn't say that it's spicy, even though it has a pepper on it. Hot Honey time. Again, I don't know if this is going to be spicy, so I may have to run and get a drink. Not much in the flavor dust. Here we go. There's some kick to it. It's not awful. I feel like eating a bunch of these would definitely build those. But, I don't know. It doesn't have too much of the saltiness as a normal Pringle. I feel like the sweetness of the honey kind of tones that down, and then there's a little surprise burning of the tongue. But it's not like awful. <laughs> we'll see how we'll see how the the lovely lady thinks of it. Is it hot? No. It's not that hot. It's barely hot. I mean, I'm probably numb to the pain when it comes to hot chips at this point. I feel like when it comes to a chip, and I think this is just me being a uh, typical stereotyping Americanizing chips, but I feel like chips need to have like a saltiness flavor to it, and this one doesn't really have that. Or it does, but the, the sweetness just kind of goes... I would say this is also a 3 out of 5 too, because I feel like it needs more salt, but that's just weird to me. So, for this next one, I'm going to prepare myself a non-sponsoring drink for the video. Now we're moving on to the very last one. The Pringles Scorching Buffalo one, which I know that the lovely lady will not be trying this one. Because... Because... What? I might smell it. The heatness. Uh, I also know that we're probably going to have to eat these within the next... Uh, I would say month at the least, because I've learned very recently that Pringles go stale very quick. Ooh. Hold on, off camera, smell test. 
barely gets on the smell. Broken, but. This is one that I know if I eat multiple of these, I'm going to probably die. <laughs> <laughs> Metaphorically speaking. I'd say taste-wise, this is probably the best one out of three that I've gotten because of the distribution of the seasoning of the heat. And it also tastes like a crunchy, meatless buffalo wing. But, as the heat test always says, we're gonna see how hot this can get. Definitely not as bad as those uh, Caliente ones. I'd say it's about the same level as the Scorching Cheddar one I had a while back. Um, I'm not really dying of like heat as I exhale very loudly because my tongue is actually on fire. Um, I would give that actually a uh, I would give that a four and a half out of five because that's actually pretty good. There's the more I talk, the harder it gets. So I'm going to end this very quickly. This is my check 95. Hopefully you enjoyed me reviewing these three random Pringle flavors. And I'm signing out. I'm gonna go set my tongue on my freezer door so I can do my next recorded videos. Not in pain. Arr.